everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Lisa from Potsy Feather and I'm back today with another project life process video for you. And today I am using the June 2017 Hip Kit Club Project Life Kit. Okay, so that time times fast. And um, I've zoomed you in a little bit so you can actually see what I'm doing and... Um, this is a week in January and still I'm using the um, June kit because I don't care. <laughs> I really like these kits. I grabbed these in the International or National Scrapbook Day sale. Maybe you have seen that. I grabbed um, one Project Life and one um, main kit plus a grab bag. You can check out the whole on my video. Uh, on my video. On my channel and here i'm using this is uh, like a letter actually letter pokey tool and i'm using to, it to poke a, a hole so um it's easier for me to put the brads through and um i do use a third one because um i always have to use everything in threes so there is that and i'm using my stiller pigment liner to um outline my card and that card is all done then next up oh i'm sorry if you can hear that there's a dog howling in the background i think it's so funny when usually people say i'm sorry if you can hear that and you never can hear it but yeah so this card i really like it but um i wanted it like i wanted the oh i'm sorry out of focus there we go. Um, I wanted it to be like the picture next to the oh snap, so I just cut it um, and um, adhered it and used some washi and done and done. So I can adhere my picture there next to the oh snap sentiment and I really like it. So I had a bit of a struggle with those Amy Tangerine. These are the On A Whim clear stickers and because they're very summery and so I struggled a little bit but I make it work and this card is done as well and um, this was a week when I had Cotenza which is a treatment I have to do every couple of weeks where <clears throat> you can see how red my foot is or my thigh so um, this is just a card I used for my stash because there weren't enough uh, for basics um, cards that um, suited what I wanted them to be, yeah, wanted, what I wanted to suit them. <laughs> um, and so I have to do this every couple of weeks and every time I take pictures and every time I scrap it. And, <clears throat> sorry, I know it is repetitive, but I still want it in my album because that's what what's happening and I really want to document it. I'm adding another bread just so it um, ties in with the other um, cards. Here I'm using a label, so these are clear stickers and even though I use, this is like a slick surface pen, but it, uh, I, I saw that it wouldn't dry properly, so I will fix that in a second, but first I'm using this camera and it didn't show up enough for me, so I decided to put it on white paper, just copy paper, and then I fuzzy cut, I'm sorry this is off camera, but I just fuzzy cut the camera. And here I'm using some scotch tape, just clear scotch tape, so my journaling is protected. And that's how I fix it. And I'm sorry, <clears throat> my voice is really weird today. And that card is all done here. You can see-ish the, the scotch tape, so how it protects it. Then here I go through the... Um, three by four cards and just I had to eliminate a few because again this is uh, January like a week in January and now when I'm doing this voiceover I'm actually up to March which is exciting and um, I'm way behind on my project life so please don't judge me I didn't want that I don't like these date and snapshot prompts I know a lot of people like them I'm not one of those people so I just cover it up with washi and do my journaling on this beautiful card I really like it 
and I add um, these are from the summer dreams the enamel shapes and I really like it add a sun and a few asterisks asterisks uh, that's a hard word to say and Ah, oh God, I love these cards. They're so pretty. And I love that they're one-sided because I always struggle with double-sided cards because usually there is... Either there are cards where I don't like both sides or there are cards where I like both sides. And then how do you decide that? So, yeah. Um, I really love to include um, screenshots. I screenshot everything. If you've been following my channel for a while, you know I do screenshot everything and anything and I love it and I, these are just little things that I just I just want to remember them and I have a feeling that if I don't um, add them in my project life, I won't. So I add them. Um, this is a QR code. I started this, I think, in February this year where I when I, I um, created a YouTube channel just a private one and where I upload um, videos like my private videos this is a video a friend sent me or yeah and I want to capture these moments and if I have them on my phone I'm not gonna watch them again if I have them in my project life and I go through my album and I'm like you know I have a journaling here and then I'm like, oh yeah, well, what's the video? I want to watch it. So I just, um, I log on to that um, private account and I can watch um, this video with uh, just using the QR code. And I love, I love that. And um, I've been starting this um, in, I think, February. Yes, I think February. And I'm obsessed. I love it. It's It brings me so much joy. And yeah. It's super easy to do. If you have questions about that, just leave them in the comments down below and I will be happy to answer them for you. So here I'm doing my, um, not title, is it a title card? I guess it is, I don't know. And I was so uh, mad because there were all of the months in this Amy Tan sticker book and I didn't think about that at the time. So it doesn't matter. And here I'm using some Heidi Sub Color Shine in gold to splatter my card and I have to adhere the stickers because they really didn't stay as always but I love how this card turned out and I think I'm almost done yes I need one filler card and I really like that do your thing so I'm just gonna um, put it on that I know it's a bit too um, wide but I don't care frankly I don't Sorry, I'm a bit off frame. I'm just adding a few little flowers and leaves and whatnot. And my card is all done. So, that what was it. Yes, that was my spread for you today. I'm going to zoom you out in a second. Oh, sorry about the shaking. There we go. And that was my spread all done. Super fast, super simple. I love how it turned out. And yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video too. And if you did, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!